Son of Heaven into a publishing project. And an old school turns into a commune for artists. We're going to pay a visit when we come back. Don't go away. Stay with us. This is 10 TV Eyewitness News. I have a story for you for people like Aaron who may want to do this full time. Uh, you know, they can do that real easily in some place like New York and Chicago, but we found out today they can actually do that in places like Columbus through a place like Milo. The music by a local Columbus composer. The interpretation by a Columbus pianist. The sounds echo nicely throughout this 1890s schoolhouse, mixing with sounds of carpet sculpting. Or a dancer warming up. Or a painter in the middle of an inspiration. The piano keys ring throughout this artist's community called Milo. So it's not only paintings or drawings, no. it can be photography it's and... It's all artists. kinds of arts. We're trying to get a pretty balanced representation of the arts. We have dance here, music, and sculpture, painting, drawing, photography. Sarah knows all about the artists here. She lives among them. Each have their own studio in this old schoolhouse. Some live here like Sarah. Artists dream of having the opportunity to be able to do that. Most artists want to have a place where they can live and work. Some artists have inclinations to do things at times that, you know, you can't, three in the morning or something. Others live elsewhere, but do their art here, like painter Daryl Duncan. Having a place that's quiet and the hours to just spend and invest on, on my art has really been something that's been really good. A 28-year-old OSU instructor has everything he needs here, running water, and plenty of room to do his art. Gretchen loves to escape to this community. For her, it's a place of creative energy. It feels good to me to come into a building where other people are working. The work is already going on. Today, artistic ideas are shared. Years ago, it was spelling and mathematics. Frank remembers those days. He was a Milo Elementary School student from 1947 to 1951. Already they've had um, art classes and workshops. And I think that's good. Good for the neighborhood. I do. Lesson sharing fills the walls of this old school. Now a different kind of sharing. Art. The art of composing, dancing, sculpting, painting. Not just a place to do art, but a place to live art. At the school, it looks a little familiar to you. That's because it used to be a mission. It wasn't until May it became a full-time artist community. Places where people can go to study art. Like